Cut uploaded his new video. It's called Sex Workers and a Partners Play Truth or Drink. Now, if, correct me if I'm fucking wrong, but ain't this Kazumi? I want to see this shit because it's like I didn't think Kazumi would ever find a boyfriend. No disrespect to her. She's not ugly. It's just she's a fucking whore. Like, every time you could come on the internet and find out how many bodies she has. And every time she talks about her bodies, she's always smiling about it. Are there things you're uncomfortable with me doing? Not really. Even if I... You, oh, she finna say some shit. On a guy or something? That's fine. See, I'm telling you, y'all be a cuck for this shit. Let me turn it up. Y'all probably can't hear it. Adam22 would love this shit. Y'all need to get his ass. Hopefully, y'all think Adam on this Adam and Sneeko? Oh my gosh, they would love this shit. If they opened up their email and heard they had to be on one of these videos, they would just be smiling cheek to cheek. This shit is nuts. Boyfriend, porn star. I'd rather pop out with the city bust down before I pop out with a porn star, especially Kazumi. Every time we see her, she's so ugly. She's not ugly. It's just every time we see her, bro, it's the angle she got. I don't think she's ugly. But every time we see her, she always smiling and talking about how her horror stories. She tells them to the internet. It's one thing to have horror stories. I right, y'all talking about I'm breathing. I'm backing it up. It's one thing to have horror stories and go about your life with it. It's another thing to have horror stories and come to the internet and tell fucking everybody. It means everybody know I'm going outside. Gucci, a fucking public server. I'm Vanity The Sims. next gen ones, too. I heard on next gen, you can have like 100 people in a public server on GTA. Escort. See, this is not too bad. Because nobody knows who the fuck this is. The Kazumi one is... Now, the Kazumi one is fake. Gucci is Gucci. Oh, my gosh. You're a fucking linebacker. I'm John, her husband. <laughs> what are you two doing here? We're playing truth or drink with sex workers and their partners. Are you nervous at all? Do I look nervous? Yeah. He's a virgin. It's his first time doing this. Sex work for me. I mean, just fucking anything that relies on your sex appeal, right? I basically sleep with men for money. What's the domination? Put in a man. Uh, this this Magic Johnson's son. Oh my God, this this not a woman. I could tell when it's like a it's one of them because it's like you know. It's too much artificial things that happened to him. Like, they were too much artificially filtered. Hey, this is none of my business, bro. And at his place, slapping him around a little bit. If he needs a little chain bondage, being the one that's going to provide that for him. I think that's what a real guy <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> that shit, he freaky. Corey in the house, LGBTQ edition is freaky as fuck. You telling me you went and got a Transformer and then on top of that, they dominating you too? It's not, it's this different from like a girl dominating you. A man dominating you, that's a whole man. He still got that nigga strength. And he looks kind of tall. Like if he could do his ass the worst way. I told y'all, yeah, this is like Magic Johnson's son. This nigga, he a cool like 6'4, 6'5, 6'6. Lucky I still hit. Hey, <sighs> yeah, bitch. You want to start off with a shot? Sure. Yeah, why not? Okay, I call Bucket. Okay. I'm gonna take the big boy shot. You're about to be silly. Yeah, you better get drunk as fuck with this porn star. I don't want my brain working if I'm with Kazumi, especially as her boyfriend. I'll be a junkie, nigga. I get drunk every day, pop pills. That's when I start. I start taking, you know, that's when, oh, that's how uh, Kodak got on that shit. Whenever he said, uh, I knew the pill was fake, but I still took it because I'm a fucking gremlin. Yeah, that's when I start doing dumb shit like that. Because, like, I gotta come home to this hoe. Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. I'll take whatever I can to get high. To keeping it real. Period. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell the truth the whole time. <laughs> Bro, play the video. First time in chat is crazy. I'm gonna make you pay for this shit. So uh yeah man, I mean to be honest with you, I just think like Yeah, bitch, leave, Mal. Leave, leave. You want to watch the video so bad, go watch it. Go watch it on YouTube. Do you wish I joined you at work sometimes? No. <laughs> no? Absolutely not. No, hell, she at Pound Town, nigga. 
I don't want you 60 feet, 70 feet, 80 feet. You lucky to even be in a building while I'm doing what I'm doing. Y'all see the Adam's apple? I wouldn't want you at work because I feel like I'm I'm being myself. And I, I feel like it's an outlet for me to express my sexuality. And I don't want you to internalize things like, oh, like, wow, she's making noises I haven't heard before. It's just its own separate experience. Are there things you're uncomfortable <laughs> with me doing? I would take a shot. Yeah. What are you taking a shot for? Truly, for real, for real, like, are there things that you're uncomfortable with me doing? Like, I have to remove myself from even like think about what you do sometimes respect that there's certain things that i just should look right there come on bro yeah we know it's a man bro let's keep it a book like y'all don't gotta keep talking about it it's poking out right bro come on dude we know there's a man it's obvious y'all talking like it's like y'all trying to build a case in chat you know mm -hmm. yeah. are there things you're uncomfortable with me doing not really honestly really like nothing even if i shit on a guy or something that's fine. That's honestly fine. <laughs> no, but that's fine. Really, the only rules. That Why is she even thinking about, bruh? Is that freaked out as she? How freaky y'all think y'all is from a scale of one to ten? We have are just so focused around your this protection. That shit got to be like a seven and a half, eight. General. And yeah. Just making sure safety. that you're safe at any point in time. He's definitely been by the door with like ten. Like ten. Room. Like I think ten is like ten is like you like to get peed on and shitted on and scat. You see what I'm saying? On that freak ass shit. It's no way. Y'all y'all niggas think y'all fucking 10? Huh? I don't think y'all need to be watching me if y'all think y'all are a 10, bro. And no, no, no. It, they can't even be 10. 10? I think 10 is probably like going out in public. You know, they be having like glory holes. You don't even know who on the other side. You just fuck it. I'm getting on that shit. Sukana is a 10. Sukiana, she 30 years old trying to keep a rapping career thriving. So she'll do whatever the fuck she can to sell records. Tell some freak ass shit. She's not really that freaky. The same way how I don't think Stacey Red really that. I don't think she burning. Man, her coochie not that fiery. It ain't no fucking way. The bitch that she got chlamydia three times. She got to be joking three times. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just 100%. Are there things you're uncomfortable with me doing? Yes. I like to be the first person to do it with you. So when I like do things with other people first, it doesn't mean that they're special or like someone that I like love or whatever. It's just like this is my work or this is an experience I personally want in my own life. Is there anything that you don't want me to do? I don't care. I don't feel entitled to your body or your experiences in that way. Yeah. I, I'm happy with what you give me and I don't expect anything. And I'm just happy when... This shit is a troll. Like, this is a troll. They trying to make us laugh. If they for real, then she's saying this. She must be getting trained every single day. Like, that's a part of her day. Come to work, motherfucking clock in. She got two niggas, two big dicks waiting on her straight up off the rip or some shit. I don't know. A bitch say that she don't care about what her boyfriend doing? Yeah, she's hiding something, nigga. Hey, is they home, though? As long as they happy, is that smiling and shit. Like, he love it. He, I don't, bro, this gotta be kept. And when we have our moment. Do you ever think about me while you're working? I try not to, actually. Oh no, my no. gosh. I literally just like zone out. I just like completely just disassociate. When I'm with someone, I want to make sure that like I'm connecting with them fully. Sometimes if I think about you while I'm fucking the guy, it moves me from the headspace of, yeah, I'm about to go ahead and fuck your brains out to... I don't want to hurt you. I want you to be okay. Do you want to water? Are you fine? One time somebody got upset because I didn't slap them hard enough. That's that's, that's the type of thing. No. That Yo, bro. I just peeped that this is DYKE. What I'm doing, sense. you know what I mean? Sense. How does my job impact our sex life? It doesn't really. I feel like it's unchanged. I feel he's lying. He's lying. Oh God! Wait till the camera move around. He has a ball spot. This nigga stressing his ass off, bro. I feel like since I've transitioned, we've kind of had sex less often. Yes. Do you miss having sex more often? No. 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 I think you should. <laughs> he's stressing like shit. Talk about um, dating me as a guy and then dating me. As well, this is different. different. Yeah. Y'all think um, he had Discord mod? definitely changed. Uh, Send me question mark. Yeah. Because I still identify as gay. 
Yeah, so, he was gay when he yeah. met me. Yeah. <laughs> This shit just keep getting worse. What the fuck do you mean he was gay whenever he met her? He got turned out. A man could get turned out. What did you think when you found out I was a hoe? I don't know. Well, I mean, like, for, for, for uh, some context, like, when I very first met her, her Instagram was super slutty. Um, I knew what I signed up for. So it didn't, it's not really shocking to me. It's, I, 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 I know that, like, this was a part of you, and, like, this is a part of you that I fell in love with. Oh, uh... Why didn't you get a lap dance for me? Because I wanted to connect with you on an emotional level rather than a sexual level. I thought it was because you were drunk. <laughs> <laughs> if we weren't together, would you hire me? No, I'm gay. Yeah, but you freaking hired me when we were like first dating. I swear, you were like the first person to like really introduce me to sex. What the work. fuck? <laughs> Please. Here we are nine years later. No. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Give him a chance sometime. Highly recommend these two games. Keep it 100 in Truth or Drink. Play Truth or Thing that happened. Do you see this as a long-term career for me? Yes. Do you want this to be a long-term career for me? Yeah, like, I want you to do what makes you happy, you know what I mean? And it's like, in the grand scheme of things, if I'm going to be with you for the rest of my life, you know, like, things are going to happen, things are going to change, but as long as you're, you know, you're happy, I'm going to support you, like, in whatever you do, so... This shit has to be a troll. Y'all gotta think about it. Kazumi says she make five million a year, right, Reg? So it's like to bag her. That's really like, sadly, that's like a W for him to bag her, cause she making five million. You know what? It gotta be a troll. This a joke. This a joke. This a humiliation ritual, bro. He getting paid to do this. Do you see this as a long term career for me? No. I don't, no? I, no, I don't, I, I mean, what, do, how do you define long term? Well, I want to do it till I retire, so. Oh, come on, like, like that's ridiculous. No, I definitely see myself doing it. Who's Kazumi, go look up on Twitter. Okay. I just feel like I was made for it, like, I don't know, I just, I like it. Do you remember who said, I love you first? Me. He tells me he loves me a lot. Do you love each other? Girl, we already know what my answer is, the question is really for you, do you love me? Do I love you? I can't say yes, and I can't say no. I don't want to risk it. Like, I'd be nervous. I'm not going to, because if I say that, it's like everything's set in stone. Do you remember who you said, remember. I love you first? Yes, I fucking do. Me, obviously. Yeah, yeah. he said, I love you. On like the third date, if that. Uh, like if two that. weeks oh, after yeah. I met Mentally him. unstable, very mentally unstable. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't tell him I loved him until six years into our relationship. <laughs> Aw, this is cute. Do you remember who said, I love you first? It was me, right? It was me. No, it wasn't. I said it by accident. Oh, you were, you were just feeling it. But I didn't think you heard it, but then you said, what did you say? And then I was like, huh? And then he was like, <laughs> wait, what did you say? And I was like, I love you. <laughs> I said it first. Oh. I think most people can't be in an open relationship, especially one that's open as much as ours. You have to be all in. You have to be willing to have uncomfortable conversations more consistently you guys should run a class how to do open relationships yeah this is the first nigga to ever and this sad because he like a nigga but this is the first male to ever beat adam 22 round of applause for him though i guess drop w's in chat for him i guess i don't know as, as long as he happy right that's what they be saying no,